an egg is laid on display, the keepers carefully replace it with the dummy egg. We take it to the candler over here. The candler has a beam of light that shoots out. We'll put the egg in front of it and then we can tell if it has any cracks in it. We'll weigh it and then we'll place it into our incubator. So the incubator's job is to mimic the parents. Um, what it does is it has the little rollers here. The rollers move the egg back and forth to make sure that the embryo doesn't grow on one side of the egg. It's really important that we get the right temperature and humidity here um, so that the eggs hatch out right. So right here we have all of the temperatures and humidity that are for the different species. So you can see for our rock hoppers here, we want to keep it at 35.7 um, and 35.9. And the humidity is going to be around 60 to 60. percent will stay here for their entire incubation period. So for the rock hoppers, it's anywhere from 32 to 36 days. After they are in here for 36 days, we'll start to pip. Um, so we'll start to poke through the end of the egg. Once they do that, we're going to move them over to our hatcher. So the hatcher is the same as the incubator, but the humidity is a little bit higher. Um, and also, it doesn't have those trays that roll back and forth. Once he's all the way hatched out, he'll still stay here for about 12 to 24 hours. During that time, they absorb some yolk that's still in there. Once they dry out, we move them to the brooder. It's a cooler with a heat source in it. So we put them in here at about 91 degrees. Um, and we'll leave them in here until they get too big for that. Once they're too big and they need a lower temperature, we're going to move them over here on the floor. So it's a little bit cooler down here, um, but we still have a heat source for them. So we keep a heat lamp on one side. That way, in case they get too cold, they can move over by the heat source. If they get too warm, then they can move on the other side of the tub where it's a little bit cooler. Once they get big enough um, and they're too warm for this room, we move them to our other room. So that room is a little bit closer to the display temperature, and that's where they'll stay.